What is up? I'm Moana Turtle. So today we're doing some more Pokemon openings. We are back in the Zard grind looking for those rainbow Charizards. Uh, what are we going to be opening today? We have more Unbroken Bonds, more Burning Shadows. Let's jump right into it. Move some of these old wrappers behind. Uh, okay, Unbroken Bonds first. Mix in a couple packs of Burning Shadows and just have a good time. Let's do this. Here we go. Code card. All right, can we start things off with a bang? Let's see, we have Fighting Energy, Mullane, Frogadier, Welder, nice, Cottony, Venonat, Meowth, Geodude, Porygon, ooh, Gengar, Reverse, I do love that art, and then Volcanion. Um, people are using this card? I don't get why he's so good. I guess this high heat blast is really easy to pull off, but it only does 111 damage. Uh, so, I believe people, I, I believe it, I believe it's good when I see people use it, but I just don't get why, <laughs> why they are. Uh, I mean, I guess the fact that, you know, with with all the welders, it's easy to to get enough energy on it to attack, and maybe it's just because it's a one prize thing. So anytime you can make your opponent have to claim more than the six prizes, for example, like uh, take out um, a couple of Volcanians and still have to take out two tag teams, I guess that's maybe that's the idea. But all right, so pretty good pull though. Red's challenge. I really don't think this card's very that good. But very good. And then a Arbuck. All right, let's do a couple packs of Burning Shadows. As always, if you guys do want to support the channel, support myself, I Want a Turtle, you can simply do so by hitting that like button. And if you're not already subscribed, definitely hit that sub button on your way out. A bunch of links down below, including Instagram, my eBay page, and others. So be sure to check those out. Looks like we do have something nice in the back of this pack. Let's see what we got. Uh, Magic Carp Reverse, and then a Salazzle GX. Very nice pull right there. Let's remind ourselves, what's the Slaza do? Diabolic Claws, this has 50 damage for each prize card you have taken. Interesting. Heat Blast 110. Hmm. Sounds very similar to this Volcanian. High Heat Blast. And then Queen's Haze GX. Prevent, discard all energy from opponent's active Pokemon. Eh. But, very nice there. Very nice hit. And, uh, yeah, so that's kind of like par now let's improve even further let's get one more hit I feel like although uh secrets any kind of like full art or hyper rare uh counts as two but i i like the idea of getting like two hits per video so lediba alolan grimer a riolu running on the beach weavile for the reverse and then a vile plume Disgusting pollen as long as you active Pokemon in your opponent's... Whoa! Oh! Is this the Vile Plume? That's the stall deck? This Vile Plume as long as your ba opponent's basic Pokemon can't attack? Oh man, that would affect the um, the tag team cards. Alright, maybe that's a good hit right there. I thought it was the other Vile Plume that could um, you know, put status effects on your opponent. And then you kind of have like just Weezings constantly pinging. Uh, your opponent, and maybe that's how you can secure victory without using like GXs, tag teams, etc. All right, Ultra Force, Cartonvoy, Golbat, Metapod, Jigglypuff, Bell Sprout, a or no, not a Lolan Diglett, just a Diglett, a Poliwag, Rhyhorn, Surprise Box, and we have a ooh, nice full art. Lucario Melmetal Tag Team GX. I really like this one just because the blue outline really makes it pop. And this card, I feel like I haven't seen done too too well, uh, but I feel like there's definitely potential with that full metal wall. And then you can have some metal Pokemon. I don't know, like maybe Celesteel. Um, wait, Celesteel Metal? I can't remember. I think it was. Um, 
And there's other things like the metal frying pan and stuff like that just to make it constantly stronger. So I'll probably start playing Pokemon PTCGO, um, but it's going to take a while for me to get enough cards to actually make any decks. Um, actually, maybe I'll, I'll probably set aside every video, set aside a couple code cards just to keep for myself. Um, so I can eventually get start playing and have some actually metal worthy decks. We have a Meowth, Togepi Reverse, and then a Per Ugly. Not a very good pack right there, but I'm real already very happy with the results of this video. Getting that GX plus a full art. Full art tag team too. N not a, uh, you know, no Persian Hunchcrow or something like that. <laughs> Alright, we have a Electric Energy, War Turtle, Cleffa, Porygon 2, Sandile, Salandit, Coughing, a Alolan Diglett, Zubat, Poliwag Reverse, and then a Marowak. So got three packs left. I feel like it's been ages since we pulled Gardevoir Sylveon. And that's a little strange because when we first picked up this set, I felt like that's all we were pulling. Oh, I keep forgetting. All right, next one, I'm gonna set aside the code card. All right, Laron, Martial Arts Dojo, Fairy Charm, Spiro, Lickitung, Litten, Krabby, Tangela, Ghastly, and can we get a third hit for this video? We get, oh, the boys. <laughs> there we go. Uh, I feel like I can make a real IRL deck of mucks. Um, oh, love this card so much. 270 HP. That's that's way more than enough. Or like compared to like Pikachu Zekrom, who's at 240. That's pretty good. Severe poison, basically poison for eight. 8 damage per tick and then poison absorption if your opponent doesn't heal it poison absorption will do 120 plus to heal 100 damage from the mucks and then nasty goo mix uh, let's just say it costs um, it costs 4 energy and does paralyzes your opponent as well as poisons them for 150 damage per tick there we go man three three hits for 10 packs so far we still got two packs left ah this is a very strong opening. Do me a favor, hit that like button down below on your way out. We have Laron, Gliscor, Triple Acceleration Energy, nice, Froki, Aeron, Seal, a Bell Sprout, Ghastly, Seal again for the reverse, and then a Butterfree. Triple Charge, shut your deck drop to three basic energies. Huh, that Triple Charge is pretty good. But stage two, that's a little bit too. Too much work to to get online all right last pack not that we need it but oh gosh <laughs> uh, i didn't do the code card again all right <laughs> eventually i'll remember it, it will be a while before i can have any good ptcgo content <laughs> for you guys we got a polyworld sand dial oddish zubat coughing a doe duo Lit in reverse, and for our last pack in this opening, we have a Agron. Okay, nothing there. But this was a very good opening. We hit three GXs plus this really good Vileplume with Disgusting Pollen. Um, I feel like I only hear people talk about this deck and I don't see it run, but maybe that's just because it's not very interesting, very uh, good entertainment because you don't really do anything. Uh, but then we get the Alolan GX, Alolan Muck, Muck and Alolan Muck, Lucari Melmel, as well as the Salazzle GX. Very happy with the results. Um, and that's all we have for this opening. As always, like, comment, subscribe, all down below. I'm Wanda Turtle, and I'll catch you guys next time. Bye!